In this video footage, now I'm going to give my family identity. I was born in Medina, Saudi Arabia in 1983. In Bar 12th Rabiul Awal, Monday was the date in the time of Fajr. And as him as Huzra Pak Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and my mother came to know from Allah that I am and I will be Imam Mahdi Alaihi Wasallam one day and uh, my family was the family members of Huzra Pak Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam we are family members uh, of Huzra Pak Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and since the time of Huzra Pak Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam there was some relatives uh, generation after generation and came to 1983 we all were me, my father, mother, grandfather, relatives all are the family member of Hazrat Pak Muhammad Sallallahu direct as a chain family member. My mother name was Amina, and my father name was Abdullah, and my grandfather name was Abdul Muttalib. But my uh, mother side grandfather's name was uh, Umar Hisham Al Arabi. On thus, when I born. Everyone become happy. In that time, Madina was uh, uh, <coughs> was a very very uh, uh, far from the light of nursing. So there was a French nurse in the time of my birth, and she was a very bad woman and <clears throat> but her help did not needed in my birth and the, that evil woman used to go in French camp there was a French camp in Modena aside in desert <clears throat> and it when I born everyone my father mother grandfather everyone was so so happy so so happy and the distributors sweat to whole Modena city whole Mokka city and time to time, even they could not cook large size of uh, sweet at that time, so they came to know that in, an Indian can cook a large size of uh, Rajbhog named sweet and and he became Muslim to work there and he started to make and thus sweet was distributed several times in Madina for my birth. And I was so so small, but in my childhood I was capable to listen, understand everything. Like Isa Salam could say from uh, his birth, and I could not speak, but I was capable to understand, rememorize, recognize everything since my childhood. And that's why I'm saying to you, Allah temporarily damaged my memory but now Jibar Salam told me everything and showed those everything like video camera record and thus I was born in Modena but uh, so many incident happened one day my grandfather on his Amal Arabi <coughs> mother saint grandfather took me to Masjid Nabi to Salam to Raza Mubarak and at that time a bad badsha was in Modena and came after drink from French camp and Jinnah. He did and came in Mozinobi without bath. And he was treated well by me in my childhood. I did dangerous punishment even I as child though. And everyone but that that king's uh, wife, king's mother, grandmother all helped me to save my life from the Bhatsha. <clears throat> because I was so small and 
then jara sat a kai maid on the chaddo though i was in the lap of my grandfather umar samal arab and ma <coughs> and thus they saved my life but after some days and there was only four story building only in madina uh, at that time in 1983 after my birth and i used to live there my grandfather mother and father used to come <coughs> thus and yet that home is visible from masjid nabi's camera nearby masjid nabi that home is yet exist and in that home was camera at that time also a good camera but not digital camera was presented and my picture my father and mother all used to take and they were very happy with me whole city knew i am the one and after some days friends came people came and attacked and shooted my grandfather umar hasan umar of the first and my mother was killed everyone they were bringing out and killing and jibril salam came from asman and sound from asman some second could be late and came and shot down everyone and changed me as a french soldier on a second large size look like them and another one become look like me in das jibril salam killed every french soldier but allah did not give permission to give life back to my family members all they killed here and also in makkah they killed grandfather and aunt or they were in <coughs> madina city at that time they killed my father mother all relatives and thus i became orphan and jibril salam took me in hand and sent me back in this country <coughs> to a house that uh, one women's son already lost it and it's also a long story why jibril salam bring me here in bangladesh and thus i started to live in bangladesh and grow big since my childhood with so many pain problems trouble i struggled a struggle after a struggle and thus i came at this situation though i never became a stop to go back in madina in 1989 or 90 i went in madina also but in, in 10 years gap happened then and after 2003 4 i again started to go back in madina time to time and thus <coughs> king abdullah used to love me so much and let's get more information i want to give uh that there was a uh, money reserve since like 1400 years that i will born money will be necessary for what to distribute in muslims so there was a lakhs of trillion dollars in madinas village reserve he was area after area buildings were built to reserve cash money in cash and madina used to give loan to large large company in this world my grandfather used to give loan my father mother grandfathers and our, my relatives all were the owner of makkah madina every had their home shop market shopping malls had bazaar all all were in makkah madina my relatives so parties and there was no one and relatives in makkah madina of my mine and we are from prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam family members as they all killed i was just alive and rabbir <coughs> hamma kamara pani sallallahu alaihi wasallam and they all were grabbed in jannatul baqi in the arrest place of fazl pak sallallahu alaihi wasallam sallallahu alaihi wasallam and after that that i became only waris of makkah madina but the skiller looters and other side people came in madina at that time and distributed lands and nets or business and nets and looted all of those monies lakh lakh trillion dollars he started bank don't know all of those and some part they give for my bearing and that's also looted by some minister of this country of that time 
and someone become else imam mahdi look like me and claimed and accepted by criminal government people of saudi arabia and thus they are looting and eating since that time my property of modina and even they sell and made property in another place of in saudi arabia <coughs> and money comes regular to their account from makkah modina and they are not really honor those are all mine I never wanted those, but they are using those money against me. That's it. Some it has become necessary. It has become necessary to attack on enemy supply line of money from looted properties of Mokka Medina. And now I'll do so. And thus, they are looting, eating. I was the only Arab of Mokka Medina. Not only that, my mother, father, all started to buy some side villages of Makkah, you know, those mountains, some oil mines, all are in my my family members' property, and I am now only alive at Waris of those, and thus, and the <coughs> evil king of that time knew where I am, where I living. But no help, never. Every struggle, problem after problem, danger after danger, face death, it's happened. But though I was never stopped, I educated all type education. Even Allah took me on the other side of Sidrat al Munta for his job for another. I became several doctorate and eight in a, so many time episode and so many military trainings. That no one has in this world even could not capable to success in those trainings yet, and thus I win in those every training, every educational qualification I achieved. Thus, ilm al adni came to me, and what Hazrat Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam suggested. It's a long history in last time episodes, last time. Hazrat brought all of my relatives. Hazrat made a lot of relation of mine, and bring all and made huge ground here in my home by Mozeza, and thus took bayat from his own side. Then from my side, then Hazrat Pakistan Salam ordered me to take bayat. I also take bayat of those followers. Even enemies are alive again. Those harm attacked on me. And who's a made dua also to Allah, and they all accepted, all accept their all punishment any time from Allah. But it's a matter of great regret. They have broken all, all of Dick's promises. Such may Allah destroy my every enemies from this. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.